Hello everyone, hope you're all doing great. Welcome back to another video. This is Manoj and this is my latest portfolio. As promised, let me walk you through the stocks that I've newly bought and with that, how much the portfolio has gained. If you see two to three months back, my portfolio was only worth about 3.22 to 3.25 crores or something like that. Today, after two to three months, the portfolio has gained close to 40 lakhs. You can see here, I have created a formula sum of all the numbers right this whole call if you look at this it is 3.67 crores where is the major addition have been added few companies have added close to um, 30 lakhs i think one of them is it cons it cons has added 30 lakh rupees in profits and then there is bradian morris literally doubled in the last two to three months and then there is a geeky voice there was some rally and in danlashmi roto spinners also there was some rally so there are like four or five stocks made up all the 40 lakhs. So that is why I always say, if you want to actually mimic my portfolio performance, you have to mimic it from top to bottom. If you buy anything in between and if you like expect the same performance, the company might be good company, but it might not move the very next day after you buy. So that is very important point to keep in mind. Now, what are the two different companies, two new companies that I've bought? First company that I have bought is Nalin Lease and Finance. This is the name that I didn't even know. One of our subscribers gave it in the community, YouTube community. I looked at it. It was like, okay. And the most importantly, the promoters were consistently buying in the market. So that is why I got some confidence. Very, very small company. This company might not suit for all because the market value, if you see that, I don't know, it is like 60 or 70 crores. It might not be suitable for all. But if you still want to take a risk, I'm, you all know that I'm not SEBI registered, but still, if you want to take a risk after your own analysis, try to put one or two percent of your capital in this company, not more than that. If it works, if suppose if the company works like the way we are all expecting, the one percent that you invest into the company might become five percent of the overall portfolio in about two to three years. Then you can rotate again, take a small company, take that five percent, book all the five percent, invest 1% in two different companies, two different small companies so that you can keep on with this cycle. Let me walk you through the quick fundamentals of the company. The company is not even 70 crores. I thought it was 70 crores. It's only 36 crores. So that leaves a huge upside to the growth of the company. We don't want the company to be the next Bajaj Finance. Even if it becomes 1% of Bajaj Finance, this is a 100x, right? We don't even want 100x. Let's suppose if the company becomes 360 crore in value into the next two to three years, that is 10x from here. That's all we need. And then we can go and do the same thing in cycles in different companies. Now coming to the point, if you look at the promoter holding, promoter holding is a healthy 72%. And the other thing that I noticed is promoters are consistently buying the company in the open market. It was 70% three years back. Now after three years, it is close to 71.5 so they are whatever they can they are just buying and within this the shareholders are still going up this is good because it creates a liquidity it creates a healthy stock price patterns let's suppose there is only 100 shareholders right apart from promoters if they buy or sell the stock will go up five percent on the upper circuit or it falls to five percent on the lower circuit the more shareholders exist in the company, the more liquidity will be generated. The share price will have a healthy patterns. So that is the other thing that I noticed. Coming to the chart, the stock has been uptrend. And that is when, when I saw this uptrend, I started to buy slowly. Okay. And coming to OPM and PM, that's a finance company. They borrow the money from someone and they lend it to someone. So OPM and NPM is okay. But pick ratio. For every one rupee the company is earning, the stock price has gone up only by 47 paise, leaving a large growth in the stock price. And even the stock PE price to earning is only around 8.5. So all these things put together makes up the framework. And that is when I thought I will take a small position. Right now, I only have 2% of my capital invested in the company. Even if it goes to zero, I have nothing to lose. But if it works, the 2% might become 10% of my overall portfolio in about three years. So that is the ideology why I have taken this company. So this is the first one on our list. Moving on to the second one, the second company that I bought is Contil India, Contil CCCC. Okay, Contil India. Contil India, this is a food exporter, exporter and importer. They operate from Canada. Contil India. Look at the stock price. Look at the market valuation of the company. It is only 66 crores. 
in the last 5 years you don't believe the stock has gone up 50 times look at this on 11th of november 2019 the stock price was only 5 rupees i did not notice for some reason this, this this company did not come into my filters but if i have bought this company i would have bought somewhere in this range when there is a volume breakout somebody something is happening inside a company which the retailers does not know what happened after that from 5 rupees or even here 17 20 rupees it is trading 200 rupees from here in this range july august september 2021 in three years the company has gone up 10x this is what i look at whether the company can make 10x into the next three years every time a company can make 10x into the next three years that is a very very good investment always keep that in mind it has to literally double every year to make 10x not even double more than that 125 percent the stock has to go up to make 10x in three years okay so this is the other thing that i actually looked at so the company is good company and it is into uptrend it is trading at close to all time high it broke out on volumes it gave total confidence for me and if you look at this website the company is into exporters and food business these are all the business that they make i did not go through much about the products and everything but i know for sure based on my instinct and experience i know the company will do really well so this is the second company i bought company is very small company is into packed foods which is leaving a large scope of growth promoter holding is not too much but it is a healthy 42 percent peg ratio is good for every one rupee the company is earning stock price is going up one rupee so this is the other company that i bought what is my expectation here i don't expect like 100x 200x and all but if it goes 10x from here do the next two to three years i am more than happy if it becomes something like 650 crores 2000 crores company within the next two to three years this is what i all expect i can go to the next business always i don't have to be emotionally stuck into one company so that is how i keep rotating my funds coming to the balance sheet the company was literally debt free so this is also the other thing that i looked into profit and loss the company is making here and there but it is slowly growing if it becomes five crores eight crores ten crores twelve crores that is when you will see the stock price jump always remember if this number stays stagnant and all of a sudden it sees a sudden jump something like this from 18 to 32 then 32 lakhs to 82 lakhs and then two crores you will see a sudden jump in the stock price this is because they are doing something differently compared to what they were doing earlier so that is when the stock price starts to jump and it will create a new trend okay so these are all the two companies that i have bought for the last month i exited three companies which i have posted a separate video if you want to take a look at that i'll leave the link in the description that's all for this video i'll meet you again thanks bye bye and take care